Guzarat breed versus Brahmin breed which is the best for milk and meat production. Are you looking for information on milk and meat producing cattle breeds? Here we tell you everything about the Guzarat breed and the Brahmin breed. If you are looking to improve milk and meat production on your farm, you have surely wondered which breed is the best for achieving this. In this video, we tell you everything you need to know about the Guzarat and Brahmin breeds, their advantages and disadvantages, so that you can make an informed decision. The Guzarat and Brahmin breeds are two of the most popular cattle breeds in the world due to their capacity for milk and meat production. Both are originally from India and have expanded to different parts of the world, including Latin America. What is the Guzarat breed and what are its advantages and disadvantages? The Guzarat breed is one of the oldest cattle breeds in the world, originating from India. It is known for its adaptability to hot and dry climates, making it ideal for tropical and subtropical countries. Advantages of the Guzarat breed High resistance to diseases and parasites. Good feed conversion to meat. Excellent reproductive capacity. High quality meat. Disadvantages of the Guzarat breed. Relatively low milk production. Tendency to be aggressive and difficult to handle. Less efficient in cold climates. What is the Brahmin breed and what are its advantages and disadvantages? The Brahmin breed is also from India and has expanded to different parts of the world. It is known for its adaptability to different climates, both hot and cold, making it ideal for countries with different seasons. Advantages of the Brahmin breed High resistance to diseases and parasites. Excellent reproductive capacity. High quality meat. Good milk yield. Disadvantages of the Brahmin breed Tendency to suffer from infertility problems. Low efficiency in feed conversion to meat. Tendency to be aggressive and difficult to handle if not treated well. Which is the best breed for milk and meat production? The answer to this question will depend on the specific conditions of each farm and the preferences of the farmer. However, in general terms, the Brahmin breed has a higher efficiency in milk and meat production, making it ideal for farms that seek to maximize their production. On the other hand, the Guzarat breed is ideal for farms that seek greater resistance to diseases and parasites, as well as excellent meat quality. What other factors should we consider when choosing a cattle breed for our farm? In addition to the specific characteristics of each breed, there are other factors that we should consider when choosing a cattle breed for our farm. Climate It is important to consider the climate of the region where our farm is located, as each breed has different climatic requirements. For example, the Guzarat breed is ideal for hot and dry climates, while the Brahmin breed adapts well to both cold and hot climates. Feeding Cattle breeds have different feeding requirements, so it is important to ensure that our farm can provide the appropriate nutrition for each breed. Production objectives It is important to define the production objectives of our farm, as this will help us choose the appropriate breed. If we are looking to maximize milk and meat production, the Brahmin breed may be a good option, while if we are looking for resistance to diseases and parasites, the Guzarat breed may be more suitable. In summary, when choosing a cattle breed for our farm, it is important to consider the specific characteristics of each breed, as well as other factors such as climate, feeding, and production objectives.